This is a moment in wine and hip hop, brought to you by Crew Love, blending wine and hip hop at the highest level. Wine and hip hop, wine and music. Why, man? Do you like wine? Are you into it at all? Check this out. You want to hold it by the step. You'll be the life of the party. Wine and hip hop really mirrors the the conversations that we have in my office about wine and music. Wine and hip hop, welcome to the show. We out here popping magnums while Mo B bag something. We in Brooklyn right now. Yeah, the borough. We got a kid from Brooklyn, Tony Rock, man. What's good? I already know it's your boy Dave Beach, man. This week, I'm on Wine and Hip Hop. Leah Robinson. Thank you. Welcome to Wine and Hip Hop TV, a deeper look at the stories behind our critically acclaimed podcast, Wine and hip hop, you know, do some cool, but that's the type of shit that we trying to do. Where, you know, look, back in the day, niggas was drinking Cisco. That's mm-hmm. wine. Mm-hmm. That's just Liquid fortified rap. wine. <laughs> yeah. You know, so we we been drinking wine. We just trying to drink mm-hmm. better quality right now. So that's what Cisco is, for real? Cisco is fortified wine, my brother. Man, I drank some of that when I was fifteen years old, <laughs> <laughs> and I ended up being butt naked on my balcony. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, I made up in my mind, you know what, I'm going to wait for that rule for drink. <laughs> Are you a red or white guy? Like, what do you prefer? Well, it depends on what you're eating, right? It goes, you know, you see white has to go with fish. He's on this, he's on this shit. And... So, I mean, you can host the show. This is our warm up. I brought something else for you, some, some fly shit. I brought okay. some fly shit for you. Fly shit. It's going to be paired with these vegan cupcakes. I hope you like red wine because we're actually going to be drinking some of the best red wine in the world right now. In the world, not in the States. In yeah, the nah, these, these are facts, man. How did you get involved with Bad Boy? How did you start producing with them? It was Francesca Sparrow, rest in peace, at Rush that told me to go up to a meeting up there to play some tracks for a new artist. <laughs> right. Go up there and the new artist is this dude named Biggie Smalls. Well, your grandparents founded Sugar Hill Records. Yes. How did you decide to get into music? I'm like, all right, cool. Leah, get so dope that people really fuck with you too. Mm. So that was in my head. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to go to singing lessons. I'm going to take music theory. I'm going to pick up an instrument. I'm going to do whatever I have to do to get really dope. And it worked. So you were focused more on producing and writing oh, I mean, yeah. You know what? Because if you watch a sitcom, to this day, if you watch a sitcom, you watch Good Times or any old yeah. sitcom, when the credits roll, yeah. the names behind the cameras stay the same. The same name scroll from Good Times to Happy Days to mm. uh, Co- Cosby Show to Cheers, the same name scroll at the end. But the names in front of the camera, you only see those guys for a few years. So I was trying, I'm trying to go behind the camera and live forever. We're drinking Lambrusco now, just because I thought that this is an interesting uh, varietal. You know, varietal means a type of grape. So you about to get on your wine shit. So the song that you picked, I Love the Dough. You picked Drake's Nice For What. Yes, which I love Drake. I tasked you with picking your favorite song from 1998. Which was not easy, which was not easy. Let me let you know that right now, it was very difficult. But I went with twins, Fat Joe and Big Pun, because Big Pun said a line in that song that was the epitome of the golden era of hip-hop at the time. I want to play your song of choice, Drake, Nice For What, and I want to introduce you to this wine that I paired. It's a 1990s Sudoro. Uh, you're not going to find that in no retail stores. That's the type of exclusive fly shit that Ooh. I like to try to bring to the table. Okay. Bro, brought it out my cellar this morning. I've had this for a minute. And only the best for the best, you know what I'm saying? You so, know, I like your thinking. So we about to pour some real fly shit up, right? Uh, this is a bottle of Dujac. It's Domaine Dujac. So for this particular joint, for I love the dough, I went with a um, 1997 Fellini Montrachet Laflave. You could, what I would do, so you give it a swirl like this, just to open it up and give it some air, right? And so turn it me into a wine connoisseur. Here. That's exactly, yo, I'm telling you, you talking about me with the ladies, like after this, you're gonna be coming, you're gonna have the restaurant, like, all right, baby, so just swirl like this. <laughs> then in this spot where it's from in France, it's just like a whole bunch of neighborhoods that just make, that just grow all the best grapes. Okay. The government actually recognizes certain ones of quality. So the term crew, all that means is 
a vineyard or a group of vineyards of recognized quality. It's like USDA yeah. for wine. Exactly. Okay. The first thing that you're gonna look at is the color. I have to admit though, not the average type of Chardonnay, white type of wine that I, I've drank before. Tony Rock. You know what I mean? Yes. You and your kind of sewer shit now, <laughs> hey, man. man. Now I know. But then, where do I want to be listening to this? When we played this record in here, that we had like a little party, you know. Yes, you came, you came with the murder mommies up in here. Yo, you had your whole squad okay. in. Your squad, your squad is a hundred percent gang, squad, gang. All right, gang, we had gang. the whole squad was yes. official, and that's why I chose this particular one. Oh, thank you, man. Oh, oh wow. Oh wow, he really, really pairing this wine and yeah, food man. thing together. I, it's a whole like vibe. That. It's a whole, yo, we about I to play out of the dough after this and we be lit. I can dig it. Thank you, man. Appreciate you. I yes. like it's a whole I like vibe. this show. You need to invite me <laughs> at least once a week. Rock, shout out to Dujac, my new AKA from now on. Dujac Rock. Dujac. Dujac Rock. Uh.